All right, we're in the Chrome Song Maker, and I'm about to make my song. Notice that there's a darker blue line right in the middle, and I want to start my melody right above that. So I click on that little uh, box right above that blue line. Here I'm putting in some notes. I'm kind of going up the scale, but let me skip and go up a little bit higher. Now let me go back down a little bit lower to finish up my melody. So I'm just putting in some notes here. And this melody should be pretty good. So I'm going to play it all the way through by clicking on the play button down the bottom left hand corner. Okay, that's not bad, but it's going too quickly. So I'm going to change the tempo. I'm going to slow it down. That's what tempo does. Makes it faster or slower. Slow that tempo down. Let's do it again. The tempo's better. But you know I don't like that middle section right in the middle. So I'm going to delete this note right here. I'm going to click on it to delete it, to remove it. So I can either play it or remove it. I want to remove that note and try a note a little bit higher. Let's play that one and see if that melody sounds any better. No, I don't like that at all. So let me change that note. Take that note out. Put a different note in. Let's try this one now. I'm playing this melody. Oh, yeah. Okay, so I like this melody a lot. I'm going to keep this one. This is going to be my melody. If I wanted to make a new melody, I could restart, or I could just undo the last couple of notes that I put in. But I like this one, so I'm going to save it. So I click on Save, and it's saving it up into the Music Lab. It's a long URL, but all I need to do is click on that Copy Link button right there. And it's going to copy that link for me. Now I need to put it into a word processing document, or I need to save it somewhere so I can get back to it a little bit later. So I'm going to open up Word. I'm going to make a new document in Word. And I'm just going to paste that URL, that link, into this document. I'll go ahead and save this page, and I'll be able to get back to it. And that's all I need to do for this part of the assignment.